Okay, so here we have the second um, video. So this one is doing the same logo, the HMV logo, using isometric projection. So you see I've drawn the um, the grid. So what I've done is I've set up my axes here at 30 degrees, going this way, and 30 degrees going this way. And then I've set up my vertical axis here in the center, where the two of them meet, right there. Then I measured out my length, which is 250, my height, which is 100, and I've drawn in my grid at uh, 30 degrees. So I'm just going to pull up the question sheet again, and I'm going to construct the HMV, this time inclined at 30 degrees. So if I just open this up, so here you see we have the HMV. This time I'm just going to construct it starting from the V, um, because I have this corner here where the V will be. So I'm just going to zoom the camera in so you can see what I'm at. There we go. And I'll start up here in the top corner of the V. And I'll work my way across drawing the front face. Hopefully not making any mistakes this time. So two, skip three, one, two, three, two, skip one, and uh, three. Skip four and add three. Skip one and two. Skip two. And I should have two left. Yep. Okay. Got the top edge done correctly. I'm as well do the bottom edge here now. So I'm going to come in two squares on the bottom to find the bottom of the V. Come across three. Skip three. Come across two, and that doesn't add up this time. So in two. Oh no, it does. Yeah, sorry. Just making sure that that point and that point were in line. Across two, skip three. That would be the center point. Skip another three. Come across two. Skip one. Come across two. And I should have two left at the end, which it will be. Okay, I'm now going to find this center part of the V here, this little horizontal line. So I'm going to come up, which is four boxes, so one, two, three, four, and come across to there. I'll also find this point here for the M, so it'll be in the dead center, so it'll be in three and up. One, two, three, four, five, up. So it's in the very center. Two, four, five. There we go. And I'll mark that in a bit better. And I can then start constructing. So I'm going to start with the V. I'm not worrying about making a 3D just yet. I'm just going to draw what it looks like at the front. Nearly all done. And the last two lines, just there. Okay. <clears throat> now that we have that, we can start worrying about making 3D. So I'm going to come back again. I'm going to start at the V. We can see that the thickness is still the same, 10 millimeters. If I move over here, 10 millimeters. So. I've measured back 
That's 30 degrees, 10 millimeters. And I've created the crate that it's all going to fit into. So I've measured back 10 millimeters, 10 millimeters to come up the same height, so 100, and come back out to meet. I know that this B is going to come back 10 millimeters, so it's going to come back to that corner and stop there. Same as this point. Always use my T square when I'm doing this. And find this here. And I can turn that up. Oh. Don't throw away your pencil. There's the B finished. It's the same thing then with the M. So I can start at the top. Come back. I can drop that down. Oop. So it's got moved a bit. So if that happens, don't leave it like that because you will lose maps. Fix it. Lots of people make the mistake here of um, bringing it up vertical. Remember, it's going to remain parallel. So I'm just going to join it parallel. The same up here. I'll come back to this point here. Join it parallel. The last two lines missing. And now for the H. So most of this back edge of the H will be hidden. My set square, my T square has been a little bit off. You can see it moves a little bit, so I have a bit of inaccuracy here. And fix it. So, and the last line missing just there. And there we have the HMV logo in isometric, making sure all my lines are in solid. Like that. So, hopefully, these two videos have helped. Best of luck.